are leaving for our vacation. Jayla is already asleep in the bed. Huh? Yeah. Um, there's someone driving, thank God, because I don't have to drive. Well, somebody's got the tall, tall hair syndrome. And I got um, humidity hair syndrome. And anyway, we are on the road, headed to the vacation. I just love this. <laughs> I think I'm gonna eat my little gas station egg and cheese for sandwich and my little coffee and then I may just do some writing because it's nice and early. I love writing in the morning anyway uh, right here all right first stop first stop guys we all, well, what you mean? We all getting out. You gotta use the bathroom? Mm -mm. Huh. Oh. Alright, so we about to get some of that grand old Chick fil A. That filet filet. Oh, I need to throw this trash away. I need this trash. Huh? I just need a stretch. Yo, we are inside Chick Fil A, and they—I've never seen this kind of trash can before. They are super high tech. Okay, let me show you this. If you want to throw something away, you just do that. You just wave your hand over it, so you don't gotta touch it. Yo, that's look at this dopeness. I don't know why the most um, simple things or uninteresting things excite me or I show interest in. Anyway. Well, Some juicy glassy lips. <laughs> oh, no. the, the chicken minis that come in a drink as well. The four count. Jayla, do you, will you eat my hash browns? Yeah. Well, actually, I just. Yeah, watermelon ice. Yeah, that's it. Like a deluxe non chicken roll with ice cream. So, four count minis. It's all very high strength. He's silly. He's silly. <laughs> He's so funny. <laughs> Stop, Jayla. <laughs> so what? Say hi, Jayla. I like it. It's pretty dope. I'm not getting every girl. Your face is fine. Did the you wash your face nowhere. this morning? Yes. All right, then. What's your problem? Anyways. Girl, look at my light. I got some light coming from that way. What are you talking about? No. Hello. Nowhere. That's, that's just... right. No, you don't want it to be too bright where it's washing you out. And then that's why you tap it and it makes you look sun kissed. Oh, that's what they do these days. I don't know. You didn't know? Yeah. That's what you're supposed to do. Look. Do that. Tap it. <laughs> it's not going to work. Anyways, um, we have like four more hours to go. I did write something which I'm kind of excited about about it and I'm actually gonna shoot it. Um, Jayla's gonna be my actress. Where's your ego at? In the car. And this little one little curl is holding on tight. <laughs> she said her curl was holding on tight. I don't know why I'm hungry again. Your eyes are pretty. You got some brown eyes. Mm -hmm. Look pretty brown eyes. Pretty brown eyes. Oh, uh. You know. <laughs> she joined it. That whole, what is it? I thought she was on the sidewalk. I'm about to say, what is she doing? Anyways, y'all. Um, I got this nice little strawberry passion lemonade tea. All of that in that one little tiny cup. I should have got a large. All I needed. To do. What are you doing? I don't want to. Bow. Bow, 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 bow. I keep kidding that lady behind All right, question. Would you rather have a job that you had to stand up your whole life or sit down? 
like a job. Stand up. What about you? A job that you had to stand up all the time or sit down? For your entire life? Look that walk. Yeah. You got stuff right here. Dang, Jay. Kind of violent. I don't like walks. Ooh, wee. You or got bees. stuff. Let me help you. I hate being stung. Me too. My leg was... What would you rather do? You feel that crusty? Would you rather... Um... Stand up for your job or sit down for your job? I would it depends up. on who I'm working with. Depends on who I'm working with. I'm mm -hmm. working with people that are cool, then I'd rather stand up because we'd be cracking mm -hmm. jokes. Next. I'd rather stand up because I'd play some music and be dancing. Oh, cool beans. All right, would you rather have a jacked up haircut for the rest of your life or be bald? I'd be bald. <laughs> would you rather have would you rather be bald or have some jacked up braids in your hair for the rest of your life bald because I can always throw on a wig <laughs> alright Jayla would you rather have no fingers or no eyes no eyes Oh, what about you no fingers or no eyes you got pick one about my fingers, I'm going to have to sit there and watch them <laughs> <laughs> but they're talking about me about my eyes, and I ain't going to be able to see them, so I ain't going to care. What about you? Mm -hmm. Would you rather have no fingers and no eyes? Born this way? Or yes. Happen? Let's just say you were born this way. No eyes, no eyes. Thank you. You too. Mm -hmm. You said no eyes? You'd rather have no eyes. Man. Yeah, I was born that way. I'd rather have no fingers, yo. The world is too beautiful. Would you rather live in a cave or a tree house for the rest of your life? Tree house. Really? I, I just knew you was gonna say a cave. Well, I was say cave, but a tree house, I would better tell you who you walk with for me. Cave is only one way in, one way out. True that. Cave, you only have one way in, one way out. And a tree house, so you can tell who walking up on you. What would you do? Jayla. Yeah. Would you be rather be an astronaut or a deep sea diver? Deep sea. What about you? Would you rather be an astronaut or a deep sea diver? Astronaut. Astronaut. Okay. Would you rather? Um, would you rather be invisible or be able to fly? Um, invisible. Invisible or be able to fly? Fly. Like fly a like a bird. I always fly away. How would you know what? Huh? You have to learn real quick where everything is. From the bird's eye point of view? Yeah. Pretty much. Just use your phone. <laughs> GPS for the air. That would be dope. I don't know what I would rather be. Invisible? Fly? Oh, it reminds me of my piece that I just wrote. Stay tuned for that. It'll come soon. Anyway, last question for right now is would you rather be rich and famous for the rest of your life or be in love and have wisdom? What? What's the second one? In love and have find love and wisdom. Find love and who? Wisdom. Would you rather find love and wisdom or be rich and famous? Love and wisdom. You come with me. You ain't getting no love but being famous. Amen. You like fake love. Yeah. Conditional love. Are you born this way? Huh? Are you just born like this? Or <laughs> why you gotta be so because technical? It's a difference. It's a difference. If you, got what? if you either got famous after no. or you born famous. Would you rather just flat out be more rich and famous? Am I born or that have way? love and wisdom? Or am I just saying like tomorrow? I'm let's difference. okay, let's say let's say it's tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah. I would say rich and famous. I would. Now if I was born, I would say love and not and uh, wisdom. What's the difference? Well, we see where I stand. You know what the difference is? What's the difference? If you're 
you're born and all you know is love and wisdom, you'll be rich. Now, if you come into it, you know the pains of love, and you know the journey and the struggle, and you know that even when you were regular and had only no money, people were still were showing you fake love, so why not just live it up? Now, if you're born into it and all you know is love, you know, I suggest stay there forever without ever knowing the pains of life. That's why I said that. Well, my answer would definitely have to be love and wisdom, as you know, if you know me. But to respond to his comment, um, hey, whatever floats your boat. Um, however, that's just, you know, whatever is in you is going to come out of you. So what I would say is, thank God Jesus wasn't like that. Because he sure knew the pain and suffering of love. And he endured it so that we could have life. Okay? I'm just saying. So, I choose love and wisdom. I can be, I can be on my balcony. Pushing my Lambo. I'm, a, I'm an introvert anyway. So. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> As I said before, I wouldn't have the people in my life that I love so much if I chose to be rich and famous over you love and, and famous wisdom. And famous. I guess if the only way that to so understand what it means to be famous, you don't understand what it means to be famous yet. So maybe if you, maybe that's what it is. He he did, has experienced love before, so that's probably why he can speak on that. So like if you feel. But we don't know genuinely what it feels like to be rich and famous. All we know is what people tell us, right? And what it looks like. You said right. No, what do you mean? What, what, what is it? What do they tell you? What you just said, that they're in isolation, which you like. I understand that you're an introvert. But you also don't like to be around disloyal people, which that tends to happen. So you have to always watch your back. Well, you got to always watch your back anyway. Well, that's what I'm saying. There's not much to do are we in Alabama? <laughs> she ready to be in Alabama. We're in, we in Columbia. Columbia, Tennessee? Uh-oh. Because I see a lot of... Oh, my God. She, she see a lot of what? I'm tired of bees and walls. Mm. As soon as she got out off the airplane in the Bahamas, she got stoned by something. I didn't even get out of the airport yet. Wow. Like, anyway, what? we're going to finish eating, and then we're going to get back on the road. Yeah. You ready? Here we go. Oh yeah, don't forget, don't forget, don't forget, don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is hit the subscribe button and you have to be, for the people who don't know, <laughs> some people don't know how to subscribe. I know because they've told me. So this is how. What you do, you have to be logged into your Google account, okay? After you are logged into your Google account, then while on YouTube, you can actually hit the button that says subscribe, okay? Hit the subscribe button for me, share this video if you don't mind, um, and like, comment, <coughs> hit that notification button. Follow us on the journey. Peace. Hugs and hugs. <laughs>